going on guys it's rosie here and um i am finally back from a long break that i've been taking i'm so sorry for not being active and keeping the series going like i said i would but like i said a lot of stuff has been coming up recently in my life and i've been really busy with school but i promise i will start those series soon i will never cancel them because they're just too fun to make also, if you guys have any questions, just leave some questions down below, and um, I will reply. So, as you can see, the title, which is probably why you guys are mostly here, I'm going to go ahead and dive into what happened to that. Well, yesterday afternoon, I was leaving school, and... um. My school, it's very crowded. There are tons of people. I mean, of course, it's high school, but as I was leaving, I saw a long line to be able to get out of the school's neighborhood that I did not want to wave in. So I decided to try to make a shortcut, which was a very, very bad idea that I made because it was very crowded, like I said, and um, there were a bunch of cars so as I tried to cross the street, a car that was not even going the speed limit of the school, which is supposed to be 15 miles per hour, he crashed into the side of my car. T-boned me, but it was a passenger's side. It wasn't a driver's side, which I'm very glad for because I really could get hurt. But I am fine. <laughs> I wasn't injured, and I'm, I'm really glad I wasn't injured or anything. Yeah, that was one of the events that happened. I had to wait about two hours for the police to arrive and ask me questions on what happened and everything. But if you guys are driving, just be careful. Don't make a stupid mistake I did. I mean, I could have sworn I checked both ways, which I probably did. But this is what I think that happened. The car was hiding behind another car, like, blending in, and I didn't see it. And... When I saw that car go by, I went, but he was speeding. It, oh, it was it was horrible. So I'm waiting for another car, which I will be getting today, and I'm gonna take it on a test drive as soon as I get it. Yeah, it was it was just very very scary. And um, today I'm feeling fine. I didn't go to school or anything because of course I'm too sore to go, which kind of sounds like a silly excuse, but. I don't think I could have made it today, but I'm very thankful that nothing bad happened to me, like death, serious injuries, or even paralyzed. Just, everyone should know this rule. Make sure you always have a seatbelt. Please have a seatbelt. My arm is really sore, though, where I knocked into the door of the driver's door. I hit my arm against it really hard and um, the seat belt jerked me, which hurt my chest and all of that. It's just sore today, but I'm just really glad I'm fine. So if you guys have any stories you want to tell me in the comments, I tell me. I would love to read them and I will reply. And that is all I have to say. Peace out. See my days are cold without you. I'm hurting while I'm with you. See my days are cold without you.